everyone i hope you can see me and i'm audible as well so today's session is uh, more of uh, high intensity training where you will have lot of jumps i'll give you the variation of the jump uh, second we'll have yoga which will have more of middle split preparation and third will be core so we'll try to do at least 15 minutes of core let's see if the time permits we'll be able to do it I'll show you the first exercise. We'll be doing five exercises and we're trying to repeat it three times. That's what my aim is, but I'm really not sure if we'll be able to do it or not. Let's see if we have stamina, we'll do it. First exercise is jumping. You're changing your leg and then you squat. I mean, you take a lunge. Lunge. Again. Lunch. Lunch. Okay. This is the exercise. You have to do it 45 minutes and then we take a pause. Move on to the second one. We so start the first exercise. In one, two, three, start. Lunch. Lunch. Lunch, 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 switch, lunch, lunch, switch, platform. Lunch, lunch, come to center. Good. Second exercise, watch me. You take a jumping jack and then palm down, hop back, hop out into plank jack, hop back, hop forward, again jumping jack. Okay, I'll show it again. Jumping jack, hop back. Hop outside, center, hop forward, jumping jack. Okay, we'll do that for 45 minutes. I don't have space. I'll just move it a little. One, two, three, start. That's it. We end here. What's the next one? It's a long jump. Watch it. We will jump to the other side. Jump towards the other side. Again. Jump. Jump. Jump to the other side. Jump. Jump to the side. All right, you'll be doing that for 45 seconds. One, two, three, go.
to imagine you have a skipping rope and you are skipping four rounds. What's this? One, two, three, four, and then you twist. One, two, three, four. Watch it again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's it. Okay. Forty-five second restart now.
Third exercise, long jump. If you have knee pain, instead of taking jumps, you can squat, other side, squat, other side, squat, okay? If you don't have knee pain, you jump, you double jumps. One, two, three, go. Last five, four, three, two, one. Skipping and twisting. One, two, three, stop. Last five, four, three, two, one. Last one, butt kicks. Last five, four, three, two, one. Pause. Take a second, half a minute of break, and we'll be back. Come to center. Let's begin the yoga part. I think two repetitions are good enough. Otherwise, we'll be short of time for yoga. Now bring your right leg to the left side. Touch pinky toes together. Lift both arms up. Use your right hand to grab left wrist. Inhale, extend. And exhale, bend to the right side. Inhale, center. Exhale, palms down. Release right leg. Use your left leg outside right foot. Inhale, arms up. Use your left hand to hold right wrist. Inhale, extend. Exhale, bend to the left side. Inhale, center. Exhale, palm down. Inhale, bring legs close to each other. Stand in front of your mat. Inhale, lift both arms up. Look at the thumb. And exhale, start leaning forward and down. Bringing head and chest down and towards the thighs. Arms down on the ground. If your palms don't reach down, it's all right. You can bend the knees and drop the palm down. Now take right leg behind. Front knee bent. Back leg straight. Into low lunge position. Keep the right leg lifted above the ground. Take a deep inhalation and exhale, straighten out left leg. Again, inhale, bend left knee, head up, chest up. Exhale, straighten out left leg. Inhale, head up, chest up, look forward. Exhale, straighten. Inhale, head up, chest up. Exhale, straighten. 
Inhale out. Exhale five. Inhale out. Exhale six. Inhale out. Exhale seven. Inhale out. Exhale eight. Inhale out. Exhale nine. Last one. Inhale out. Exhale ten. And pause here. Try to bring your chest closer to the right thigh. If it's very difficult for you to keep your thumbs down, you can have a slight bend in right knee or move your right leg a little behind to bring the thumbs down. Stay here in this position to get the stretching left leg. Five, four, three, two, one. Bend left knee. Walk towards the right side. Turning both toes to the right. Lift halfway up and exhale. Bring your head and chest down towards the ground. Try to keep your head, crown of the head, on the ground if possible. Stay here with your knees straight, back long, stomach pulling. Keep breathing for five, four, three, Two, one. Now slowly walk towards the front of the mat. Walk towards the left foot. Take left leg behind. Get into plank pose. And exhale, drop knees, chest, and chin down. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, hips up. Get into inverted V. Stay here. Breathe. Take a, take a nice stretch. In your legs, in the hamstring, trying to press head and chest down towards the ground. Now slowly put your left foot forward. Put right leg forward in between the palm. Inhale, halfway up. And exhale, bring head and chest close to the knees. You can try to hold ankle or toes and bring head and chest close to the knees. Start pulling. Inhale, halfway up. Exhale, palms down on the ground. Take left leg behind. You have to repeat the same thing on the left side. Bend right knee. Look up. Look forward. Inhale. Exhale, straighten out right leg. Bring head and chest close to the right knee. Inhale, head up, chest up. Sink hip low. Look up. Exhale, right leg straighten out. Inhale, head up. Exhale, three. Inhale, up. Exhale, four. Inhale, up. Exhale, five. Inhale, up. Exhale, six. Inhale, up. Exhale, seven. Inhale up, exhale eight. Inhale up, exhale nine. Last one, inhale up, exhale ten, and we pause here for five, four, three, two, one, slowly bend right knee and turn towards the left side. Walk both palms to the left, turning both toes to the left side. Bring your palms in line with the legs, take a deep inhalation and exhale, bring head and chest down towards the ground. Try to touch the crown of the head on the ground and stay here in this position. Go five, four, three, Two, one, so we lift head up, chest up, walk towards the front of the mat, walk forward, take right leg behind, get into plank pose, and exhale, drop knees, chest, chin down, inhale, slide forward, exhale, hips up, inverted V. 
Inhale, lift right leg straight up towards the ceiling. Push your leg high. And then bend right knee, opening the hip. So you're pointing your right knee up towards the ceiling. Pushing it to the left side, opening the hip as much as you can. Stay here in this position and breathe for five, four, three, two, one. Now slowly step right foot forward in between your palm. Now walk palms to the left side. Sink the hip low to the left, not completely down. Keep an active engagement. We are not sinking the hip completely down. Left knee is bent, but hip is still hanging in the air. Now walk to the right side. Hip is not completely down. Hip is slightly up. Right knee bent. Again, go to your left side. Bend left knee. Go to the left. Come to center. Go to the right. Hip is not completely down. Keep it parallel to the ground. To the left. To the right. To the left. And let's drop the hip completely to the left side. Drop your hip completely down. On the left side. Left side. Both hips are down. Now. Open your right arm up towards the ceiling, left arm on the ground. Right arm up, open the chest to the right side. Look at the right fingertips, stay here, breathe. Five, four, three, two, one. Come back to center. Now, rotate your leg and drop left knee down on the ground, left toe touching the right thigh. Slowly walk both palms forward, bring forehead down towards the ground. Walk your palms in between legs. And if your right hip is lifting up, it's all right. Let it lift up. Walk palms forward. And stay there in that position. For five, four, three, two, one. So lift head up, chest up. Bring left foot on the ground, lift hip up, walk towards the front of the mat, put your palms down on the ground. Now take right leg behind, get into plank pose, and exhale, rock knees, chest, chin down. Inhale, slide, and exhale, hips up, inward, take three. Now lift left leg straight up towards the ceiling, push your left leg higher, push it up, push it up. To the maximum. Now bend left knee. Open left hip. You're pointing the left toe to the right side. Left knee up towards the ceiling. Lift your left knee up. Point it up. Stay for five. Keep lifting. Four. Three. Two. One. Now slowly step left foot forward. In between the palm. Now walk both palms to the right side, hip low to the right side, but not completely down. Go to the left side. Sink the hip low to the left, but not completely down. To the right. To the left. To the right. To the left. To the right. Left. Now go to your right and drop hip completely down on your right side. Now take your right arm inside of the right leg and put it on the ground. Hip is completely down with your right knee pointing up towards the ceiling. Sit down on your hip. Right knee pointing up. Right foot on the ground. Lift left arm up. Look at the left fingertip. Stay here in this position. Five. Four, three, two, one. Come back to center. Rotate your leg and drop right knee down on the ground. Right toe touching left thigh. Now bring both arms in front of you and walk in between your legs, stretching both arms forward, forehead down towards the ground. Stay here in this position for five, four. Three, two, 
one, inhale, lift head up, chest up, come out of the pose, put right foot on the ground, lift head up, walk towards the left side of the mat, put the palms down on the ground and take left leg behind, get into plank pose, plank pose, good, exhale, drop knees, chest, chin down, and inhale, slide forward, exhale, hips up, inward, 10 feet. Now lift right leg straight up towards the ceiling, push it higher, bend right knee, open your hip, right knee pointing out towards the ceiling, lift up, open it up more and now slowly step right foot forward in between the palm, good, rotate left heel down, warrior, swing left arm forward and behind, warrior, two pose, stay front knee bent, Back leg straight, chest turning to the left side. Push the hip low, sink it down. Stay here, breathe. Now put both palms on your waist. Inhale, straighten out right leg. And exhale, bend right knee and try to push your hip towards the right heel. Inhale, come up, straightening out right leg. Exhale, two. Inhale up, exhale, three. Inhale up, exhale four, inhale up, exhale five, inhale up, exhale six, inhale up, exhale seven, inhale up, exhale eight, inhale up, exhale nine, inhale up, exhale last and we pause here for five, four, Three, two, one. Inhale, lift up, lift up. Straighten out your right leg. Stretch both arms to the side. Bend right knee. Push the hip down. Get into warrior two pose. Now release right palm down inside of your right leg. Left arm in line with your ear. Your back off. Your upper back is touching right thigh. So don't lean forward. Keep your spine in line with right thigh. Stay here, breathe, stay, stay, now slowly bring your left palm down to the ground, drop your left knee down and then you come on your left knee with your right leg straight, you turn completely to the left side, left toe and left knee both in one straight line, I'll show you the side view, for your left knee, left heel, one line, Right is extended to the right side, okay? This way, once again, put your right palm on right thigh and push your hip to the right side. Push it to the right. Push your hip to the right side. Inhale, slowly come to center. If you have sensitive knee, fold your mat and put the knee on it. Second round, only five rounds here. Bend right knee, push the hip down. Two. And three. Four. Five. We pause here for five. Four. Three. Two. One. Inhale up to center. Now slowly turn towards the front of your mat. Take left leg behind. Take right leg also behind. Plank pose and exhale, drop knees, chest, chin down. Inhale, slide forward, exhale, hips up, inward, 10 V. Now lift left leg straight up towards the ceiling. Inhale, push left leg higher. Bend left knee, open the hip, left knee pointing up towards the ceiling. Open, open, open. And slowly step left foot forward in between your palms. Rotate right heel down, swing right arm forward and behind, warrior two legs. Chest is turning to the right side, stay here, sink the hip low, put both arms on your waist, take a deep inhalation and exhale, push the hip to the left side, inhale up, exhale two, inhale up. Exhale, three, inhale up, 
exhale four inhale up exhale five inhale up exhale six inhale up exhale seven inhale up exhale eight inhale up exhale nine last one inhale up exhale ten and we pause here for five four three two one inhale center Ooh, my legs are burning stretch both arms to the side bend left knee and sink your hip low into warrior two release left palm inside of left leg right arm in line with your ear into side angle pose chest open sink the hip low so that right hand to right toe are in one straight line stay breathe now slowly put right palm down on the ground turn your right toe drop right knee down now bring your right leg right toe behind the right knee and left leg extended to the left side fold right fold the mat for your right knee it will protect your knee right toe sorry left toe pointing away from you now put both palms on your hip inhale Exhale, push the hip to the left side. Inhale, up. Exhale, two. Inhale, up. Exhale, three. Inhale, up. Exhale, four. Inhale, up. Exhale, five. And we pause here for five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, up. And exhale, slowly turn towards the front of your mat. Take your legs behind, get into plank pose. And exhale, drop knees, chest, chin down. Inhale, slide forward. Exhale, hips up. Inward, take B. Lift up. This is the last round of vinyasa when you will be doing some hip stretches. Lift right leg straight up towards the ceiling. Inhale. And exhale, right leg forward in between the palm. Good. Now slowly turn towards your left side. Lift head up, chest up. Come out of the pose. Stand up straight. Good. Now turn toes outside, 180 degree angle in your leg, in your ankle. Palms in front of your chest. Inhale. Exhale. Bend both knees, sink the hip low into prayer squat. Inhale up, stretch the arms up, spread out the fingers, five pointed star. Exhale down, prayer squat. Sink the hip low. Inhale up, prayer, five pointed star. Exhale down, prayer squat. Inhale up, five pointed star. Two more times. Exhale down, prayer squat. Inhale up, five pointed star. Last one. Exhale down into prayer squat. Stay here. Sink the hip low. Go to your maximum stomach in for five, four, three, two, one. Inhale up. Straighten out the leg. We have to do it one more time. There's no escape. Take a deep inhalation. Exhale. Bend both knees. Sink the hip low. This time put both palms on your thighs. On your thighs, somewhere close to the knees. Good. Now use your right hand so that your finger is pointing up. Right shoulder comes down and you're using your right hand to push the right thigh away. Turning your chest to the left side. Your chest and leg both are going in opposite direction. Stay here for five, four, three, two, one. Come to center. Other side, use your left hand to push the left thigh away. Left shoulder down, turn to the right side. Push left leg away. Five, four, three, two, one. Inhale, center. Exhale, straighten out your legs. Now, we try to get into middle split. Start sliding your leg away from each other. You can keep your palms down when you're doing that. 
either your palms or your elbows, whichever is possible. Keep pushing it away and just stay here in this position. Either elbows down or palms down. Stay for five, four, three, two, one. Slowly wriggle your legs, bring them close to each other. Lift head up, chest up. I was mentioning about wall in today's class. So try to keep your mat closer to the wall. I'll show you what you'll be doing next. Next one is to get deeper into your middle split. Watch this out. So I start going close to the wall this way. First my hip is touching the wall. Hip is completely touching the wall. Elbow on the down, elbow on the ground. Giving me some support. Drop the shoulder down. Lift both legs up and separate legs apart. Keep hips touching the wall and your legs are separated. We'll stay here for one minute and then we move on to our core part. Separate your legs and just relax yourself. This is more like a nice break from all the dynamic movement. Stay. If you have flexibility in your legs, you can use your hands on the inner thigh to press your legs down. Keep your legs either pointed or flexed because uh, I don't want you to injure yourself if your legs are not too strong. Keep breathing, keep stretching. We don't have much time here. We'll stay here for 15 more seconds. It's a little extra for those people who took time to take your mat close to the wall and arrange yourself. Five, four, three, two, one. Slide bend in your knees. Use your hands to bring legs together. You might need extra support from your hands to bring the legs closer. Give yourself some time to relax here. Have slide bend in your knees or keep a major bend in your knees to relax your legs. And once you get comfortable, Slowly roll to one side and sit up. Come out of the pose. Come out. Now we'll move on to the core part of the class. Watch the first exercise. For the first one, we'll be doing exercises in a set of two. And then we take 10 seconds of break. Every exercise will do for 30 seconds. Watch the first exercise. You'll lift your leg up and clap behind the hips. One, two, three, four. In this one, you are not lifting the hip up. Instead, you are lifting only your legs up towards the ceiling and clap. Okay, 30 seconds. We start now, lift your legs up. One, two, Three, bring it. Bring it down and up. Clap. Down and up. Two. Down and up. Three. Down and up. Four. Keep doing. I'm there with you. Five. Last one. And six. Good. Now, let your legs be here. We'll be doing kick-ups now. So keep your palms by your side. Lift your legs up, hips up. Kick your left up. Bring it to 45 degree angle. Kick it up, 45 degree angle. This is the second exercise we start now. Kick up, 45 degree. Keep doing this 
for 30 seconds. That's it. Now slowly roll yourself up, sit up, and come into plank pose. Plank. Head to toes, straight line, stomach holding. You'll bring left knee to left elbow, sideways, right knee to right elbow. We'll do this for next 30 seconds. We start. One, two, three, go. Release your knees down. Next one is mountain climber for 30 seconds. You can choose your speed. Either you bring it this way into your chest or you run. 30 seconds. And we start. One, two, three, go. Still have a lot of time. And release your knees down. So bring both legs in front of you. Next is Russian twist. 30 seconds of twist. Watch this. Stay on your heels, lean back, and twist side to side. All right, 30 seconds. One, two, three, stop. Up to center, we finish that. Next one is in and out. Palms behind you. You will bring your legs inside and out. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale. 30 seconds. One, two, three, go. And release. What's the next one? Next one is called as 100. Why it's called 100? Because you have to do the same exercise 100 times. So you lift your legs up 90 degree, bend in your knee, or you can keep it completely straight, it's up to you. And then you flap your arms 100 times, squeezing the stomach in. All right? And let's try to finish it as quickly as possible. Take a position, lift legs up, squeeze the stomach in, palms by your side. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty seven, thirty, 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 that's it. Release your legs down. Very good. Now lie down on your back. Once again, lie down. We'll be going for 
crunches. Watch the next crunches. Here, lift both legs up. Take a deep inhalation. Exhale. Try to touch your toes. So instead of keeping your toes pointed towards you, you'll keep it away. It looks like this. One, two, three. We'll do this for 30 seconds. So lie down on your back. Lift legs up. Arms above your head. One, two, three. Begin.
Release head down. Open left arm to the left side and ground. Use your right hand to bring left knee to the right side. Look at your left, left fingertip. Stay here and